Hey everybody, it is Thursday, October 14th, and I want to go over what the game plan is for class today. Um, I will not be in, so Mrs. Bear is kind of having a an rough week. Started the week with some stomach issues, um, which I'm still having, and a bum knee. Um, but now I've also broke a tooth and have to go to the dentist today. So I'm doing great. I hope you're all doing better than I am. So let's talk about the game plan for today. So let's look at your announcement. This will be on momentarily. I still need to post it, um, but I have to add a couple things to it like this video. Um, so here's what I want you to do in SEL today. I need you to all to call your parents or guardians and sign them up for parent teacher conferences tomorrow. I did send an email, but I only uh, received um, responses back from three parents. Those are the parents of Emmanuel, Russell, and Benjamin. So uh, you three don't have to do this step. So you can move on to whatever else you need to take care of today in class. Um, so let's just talk about the parent teacher conference. You're going to open up the form that I've attached and it looks like, well, apparently, oh, it looks like this right here. So you're going to start off, put in your parent email address. So that way I can, um, email them really quickly, uh, confirmation of this, then put in their name, um, Oh, here's where you put their email for the confirmation. Let me know if they speak English. Um, if they don't, let me know what language is their primary language. Uh, please remember, I speak a little bit of Spanish, but um, I don't speak other languages. Uh, so um, that's something I have to accommodate for. And this is one of the reasons you need to attend the conference is so that way you can lead the conference um, based on what we did on Tuesday. So then you're going to fill in your, your name. Um, so I know which parent belongs to whom. And remember this conference is just for you. So if you have siblings, they need to make an appointment with that sibling's SEL teacher. Uh, these are the available conference times. Simply select the one that they want um, and it will notify me of that. And then whether or not they want to come into the building to meet in person or if they want to meet virtually completely up to them. Then click submit. That's all there is to it. So please take care of that first thing. Second step is to finish filling out your getting to know you learning plan that you will use in conferences to let your parent know um, how you're doing. So as a reminder, that is this document right here. You're going to open this up. Hi, Anthony. I have yours open right now. Um, right now, this is just the getting to know me plan, but you needed to actually on Monday, copy this document into the plan as well. Uh, Milka, I'm looking at you. I've already done this for you. Um, so I'm going to walk everybody else through this because everybody in class opened this on Friday or not Friday on Tuesday uh, when we had our two hour block together, but many of you forgot to add it into the actual document. So let me show you how to do that. So first off, you're going to hit control A and that will select the entire document. Then you will hit control C that copies it. Then if you come over here, you have to do one thing before you can get this in. And that is um, select your document here or just at the end put your cursor come up to format go down to columns make it one column not two now you can come down to the end hit enter hit control v and this will paste the this document into your document so Anthony, I just did this for you. And then you have the option. You can either leave this as a single column or you can change it back to two columns if you want. I would recommend just leave it um, at this point. 
then just come in and fill in your necessary information student name id grade i gave you your reading score and math score on uh Tuesday, so I'm not going to give it to you again. Um, Milka, I put your scores into the document already. Anthony, you should have this document already, so I'm going to take this out when I'm done explaining. Then you need to reflect on your scores. Uh, this next section you don't do because we don't have interim, so just leave it alone. Then insert all of your classes and the grade that you received for quarter one. You'll notice there's not enough rows for all of your classes. So down here, I want you to just click into the last row, click up here to format, come down to table, insert row below. That will add an additional row so you can get all your classes in. Then you're gonna reflect here by answering these two questions in the quarter one spot. Then you're gonna come down here answer all of these questions then down here you're going to leave this alone we will fill this out together tomorrow during your conference time that is all there is to this form um, so get that done once it's done please select um, to submit it so i know it's done joe this message is for you so please listen up i need you to share this document with me once you have shared this document with me i will then add in this part of the document since um, your ipad is not allowing you access to it then you'll be able to upload the whole document to the assignment page um, if you have questions about that send me an email once you are done with this then please make sure that your grade and wellness tracker is completed because that is your final tracker for quarter one. And I'm, I would like to input those grades before conferences tomorrow. Uh, just a reminder, today is really your last day to get any work turned in to get your grades up. Uh, they're going to be updating grades first thing in the morning. So it's really, 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 really important that if you're missing anything, you get it in. So that way your teacher can give you the most accurate grade for conferences. And this is mandatory for students. Um, and you need to bring your computer so that way you can show your parents this document and walk them through how school has been going. So that's it. That's the game plan today. So please get all your stuff done. I look forward to seeing you tomorrow during conferences. And I look forward to seeing you on Tuesday when we come back together for another school week. Because yeah, that's right. You don't have school on Monday. So um, I'll be thinking of you. Uh, you might even see me in your documents in class today, unless I'm at the dentist. Um, so have a great rest of your day. And I will talk to some of you later on.